Hey guys, what's up and welcome back uh, to this video. Today, something really special. This is gonna be Raven's very first ride on her new Oset MX-10. I can't even believe I'm saying the words that Raven is on an MX-10. I can't believe she is on an MX-10 now. This is <laughs> crazy. So the backstory is this is a little bit, uh, we're a little bit ahead of time. I wouldn't have put her on an MX-10 just yet. But with you know world supply and demand and things being really hard to get hold of, um, the MX-10 came up as an option. Uh, Pete Goddard from Oset Bikes down under rang us and said you can have one right now or wait till probably Christmas time. It's March, so we thought you know what, let's get it. Um, that way we've got it secured. It's ours. And then when we built it, uh, we put Raven on it, and she just kind of fit it. And I can pick it up. She can pick it up, she fits it, a um, little bit big for her, but I think we're going to be okay. So today, very first ride, we're back to a spot that we absolutely love to come, which is a little spot that we call Creek Track. It's right near our we house. We love the hermit crabs. There's hermit crabs, so we'll go find some hermit crabs. We love it because it's close to our house, it's very basic tracks, nothing too wild, a uh, perfect place to start. So here we go, Rave, first day, MX-10. Big day for us guys, Raven is first day on her MX-10. The reason I'm excited about it is the MX-10 really is the start of adventure for the kids. Um, it's the first bike that really opens up options. Hang on, Rave. Oh, you got it? Keep it going, keep it going. Oh, well done. That was really tricky. This is a big angle and slippery and slimy. Um, the MX-10 really starts to open up the options. It's got the bigger wheels, bigger tyres, um, 10 inches front and rear. It also... Um, so snotty out here. It also has a heap of power. The really cool thing about the MX-10 is you can adjust power, speed and response individually. So it's a real tractor in the bush because you can turn the response down and then have the power up. So the kids can climb crazy steep hills um, without it snapping up and wheel standing and carrying on or whatever. So it's a really, really cool machine. Of course, for me, I'm back on the trusty old um, EBMX modified Suron. This thing has been an absolute powerhouse for our family. It was a five grand investment initially, and I tell you what, it's paid for itself 10 times over. Um, the amount of riding I've done with the kids and my wife and everything on this bike has just been amazing. Whoa, Raven! <laughs> Big holes! Good job getting through that, babe. Speed up and go, that's it. Try and stay out of the big holes if you can. <laughs> She's doing so good. <laughs> Oh, I'm so excited. It's so interesting coming back to do this with a second kid. Same trails, I'm on the same bike, Raven's on the same bike that Chevy used to have. Stop there, Rave. All right. Where do you think is the best way to go? Straight there. Yeah, through that little bit. 
okay, just a little bit of power as you get up to it, okay, and get, go through it sort of a little bit quick. Well done. Yeah, this is quite the trip for me, being back on these trails, MX-10 in front of me, I'm on a Suron. Um, really good memories. Me and Chevy bonded so much in this period of riding together, um, and I'm really looking forward to doing that with Raven. <laughs> That's a lot of water. A bit deep. I reckon we might turn around and go the other way, yeah? Yeah. I don't want you to drop your brand new bike in there. Wheelie. 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 Okay. Good. up on the flat and you can stop here hey great first hill that was awesome well done yeah let's go straight down here Gonna get through here either. Our track is gone. The sand is gone. Yep. Why can't you? Just... Hey, I'm duckling. Two ducklings. Two ducklings. Yeah. Hello, ducklings. Yeah, look, we could go over there, Rave, but we don't really need to. Just turn around. We'll just turn around and we'll head back, and we'll go. Um, Go to hermit crabs? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Safe to say that Raven is <laughs> Raven is definitely picking this up, this bike faster than I expected. I thought today it'd be, you know, a little bit of a cruise, her to figure it out. Um, I thought she'd have a few stacks, a few falls, trying to work it all out, but man, she's all over this thing. This way, Rave, get down here, through those trees. 
yeah, she's taken to it really naturally, which I shouldn't be surprised. Every time we put her on another bike, a pedal bike, balance bike, um, and and now the bigger moto, she just seems to go to it really naturally. I think she's quite naturally talented. All right, that's going to be really boggy. Figure a way out. Now, don't turn too much. Yep, you need to push. See that little rut in front of you? All the way through. Good job. Well done. Yeah, every time we put her on a new bike, um, she seems to take to it much quicker than I'm ever anticipating. I don't know if I'm being, you know, a bad guy and just assuming that because she's a girl, she's going to take longer. Um, but man, she surprises me every step in bike riding. She's just ready for it, she's ready to go. Grabs it with two hands and just is gone. I think she's, I think she's actually pretty naturally talented. Maybe more so than Chev. Hey, what is, what planet are you from? Um, you are amazing. You must be from Motorbike World Planet. <laughs> I want to do it again. No, we can't do it again right now. That, that was really good, babe. Hey, Raven, seriously, I'm so impressed. Was that fun? Yeah. Did you have the best time? Yeah. Babe, that was incredible. I may do that. All right, Raven, how was your very first ride on the MX-10? Good, bro! <laughs> hey, you got a ladybug in here. <laughs> <laughs> was it fast? <laughs>